Welcome back. We have obtained our license. Data. And we've also obtained the dropship that we can use to reach the Forbidden Island to hopefully save everybody on the Sulphur Bottom. Made by Ooh. Rule's Sulfur dad's bottom. friend, who is definitely not Rule's dad. Oh yeah, this is Rock, this is Rock's room. Yep. Yeah. Kind uh, of a shithole, isn't it? Yeah. He doesn't they, actually they, much. They've increased you know, the size of the room since the first game, but it also just kind of feels more empty. Just talking about Rock's room real quick, it reminds it's me of the one scene from My Hero Academia where they're going through everyone's rooms and... Uh, Matt, what's the name of the one guy that has, like, the, the weird-looking lens? Weird. I don't know. It's like the, the giant, you mean well, the giant shoulder pad yeah, things? The, it's, it's, yeah, they're kind of like shoulders, and, like, one of them can, has a mouth of its own. That sounds like something from Parasite, dude. I think that's Parasite. Well, maybe, basically, just this... or maybe it's my hero. I don't know. I I actually haven't watched my hero. Okay. Well, basically, yeah. just to sum up, it's the scene where they're going through everyone's room, and they're going to that guy's room. And it's really bare, and it's like, oh, I see you're a minimalistic type of guy. I just don't see why anyone would be interested in filling the room with a bunch of junk. Mm. Um, also, as you've noticed, again, the flutter kind of got a bit of a bit of a boost since the first game. Yeah, that. like there's it's actually a, a shot. Game. No, I mean, that was just part of the, uh, that's no, still part of this I, I, Again, I'm just jumping between loading zones, but it, 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 like the freaking thing has like two different floors now, and anyway, we gotta talk more about the game and not our little, you know, we'd like, no, we like our tangents. Um, we're gonna go use Joe's dropship to go to the Forbidden Island to hopefully put, to, put an end to the storm and save the Sulphur Bottom from crashing because someone didn't do a good job of making sure it avoided the Forbidden Island. Yeah. I'm looking at you, Rolls Mother. Possibly hmm. in disguise, Rolls maybe. Mother. I don't know. Well, my parents were digger. Yeah, Roll is trying to like say that she wants to go on the dropship and Mega Man's having none of that. Yeah, it's like, how much digging have you done in your lifetime, Roll? I don't know how to fly the flutter. Don't worry, you can do it. Uh, we, we almost crashed the first time with Data. Menzo, that's Data, the guy I'm thinking of. Data is basically BB-8. He can pilot it. They say no one's ever returned from Britain Island. I can't let you go there, Mega Man. It's like, uh, hello, uh, save an entire island from I mean, apocalypse. I appreciate the sentiments roll, but at the same time, I'm the one that's far more capable. You're not making this argument any easier for yourself of me thinking that I should be the one to go and not you. So... Fine, yes, we've convinced her. We will go to Forbidden Island. Of course. I mean, we are Mega Man. Why wouldn't and with we? That does, that, oh, the day? Room. does that lower the morality or... No, oh, no, no, no. no. That's, that's, that, that's not morality related. Okay. Good. We also, had no choice. The, the game chose that for us. Right. Also, it's, real it's, quick, um, Mizo oh, Shuji. Okay, that's the person I'm thinking of. Oh, oh okay. thank you. Okay. And with that said... It's time to also show the big thing that this game introduced with its, with its move function. So I... Equip. Wait, nope. On my feet. <laughs> Jet skates. Woo! The big thing that this game introduced, uh, as opposed to the first one, is that normally when you do move, you just move from city to city or from point to point. Let's say for data first, because I'm really smart about this. Little kitchen burner. Much like usual, uh, you can uh, you can always talk to data in case you're ever stumped. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. He does give a little help. Uh, okay. I want to ask. Get around to this eventually. I will say oh. is that the big thing that this game did is when you hit move, this game actually has us going between multiple islands. Yep, Ooh. we're going around the world. But we're gonna stick we're gonna stick on this hemisphere and we're gonna go to the Forbidden Island. Right. Because mm -hmm. even though it's so forbidden and it took apparently years to find, we can just go right there. Well to be fair, the Silver Bottom already did all the searching for us. True. Now it's just a matter of actually going there. Although I do love it goes like, hmm, where could the forbidden I wonder if anybody for years was like, where could the Forbidden Island be? You think maybe what? it's a giant circular death tornado over there? Nah. Speaking of which, here we go. This is our way of keeping stable in a hurricane, a freaking propeller. Kind of reminds me of the little um, pod that Mr. Incredible was in when he dropped so, off the island in the first Incredibles. So does this make <laughs> does this make Mega Man an ODST? For now, yes. It depends. What does that stand for? Orbital drop shock trooper. Uh, but we, we're not dropping from orbit, so I think we're fine. So, Mega oh, Man. Well. Mega Man, are you all right? Mega Man, I Mega think Man. so. Hmm. You roll. I'm okay. Again, I do kind of miss the original Mega Man voice actor, but I still like this one. Well, in all fairness, he puberty. Exactly. Puberty hit him hard. Really hard. You can't so, stay yeah. a kid forever. Yeah. Unless I you're know. Sakurai. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. All right, let's go check out the... Wait, there we go. Yeah, right, but Sakurai still needs sleep. 
Actually, you know yeah. what? We talk about we talk about like Sakurai being aware of the fact that he's kind of overworked to no end. Do you think he's also aware of the fact that he basically reverse ages? Mm, but he just seems to look better and better with every year. I don't know. Actually, he probably, doesn't, he probably doesn't care. Actually, in a recent interview <laughs> with Famitsu, uh, he revealed that he has been taking weekends off. That's good. That's good. That he needs that. I think by this point, I, I mean, a good bulk of the game's development's already finished. He deserves a few, few breaks. I love how I love how him taking weekends off sounds like this incredible thing when most like full time jobs have weekends. I off. get the they feeling that like the second it hits health. the weekend, all he does throughout both days is just sleep throughout both days. Hibernates. You know. <laughs> whoa, 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 well, no, well, back whoa. up, back up. For some reason, it just makes. No man, no man. Look, this is actually serious. There's people. These people there. are frozen. But why are they tiny? It's child, I think. Because, I because, because they're in fetal position. Or they're buried Stuck in the, the ice. Wait. Uh, that oh, too? it's another dropship. Oh. Pretty. Do you see something? Yeah. I'm not up anyway, but she's not picking up any life signs on it, Wait. which is now, suspicious. Now I'm Let's just... About that. No, Matt, hang on. I just wanted to pull the sides of that. Yeah, that's kind of suspicious. We're actually going to look at that. We're going to probably be dealing with that later, but yeah, moving on. Much Go ahead, Matt. Like Sorry, we're past the point of talking about Sakurai. No, we can do it now. Dude, I'm trying to... When the game does something big... Oh, crap, I hate these monsters. Fuck is that? Yeah, bots. It looks like a Heartless that would be in the Nightmare Before oh, Christmas geez, world. It does. It's, I call... I like to nickname them uh, Behemoth or, like, Monster Reaver bots because they look all nice and friendly until you tick one of them off. Mm -hmm. And then they just want to give you the now. most dangerous hug. Kind of like a put player. A, put, like, a scream when they pop up into their true form. No, I'm not going to read that screen. Well, but you're going to talk. You're going to tell me about Sakurai right now, man. Yeah, just, we'll uh, make it quick. We don't know when the next just, story thing will pop up. The whole like uh, on the weekend, he just hibernates and stuff like that. All I could think of is just that uh, one lyric from the song "Working in a Coal Mine." The uh, when it comes Saturday in the morning, I'm too tired for having fun. Yeah, pretty much. Now, and now, since we're talking about like hibernating like a bear, now I'm just imagining Sakurai as Fozzie. I was thinking Yogi for some reason. Well, I say Fozzie because I was also remembering that one line from the recent Muppet Show where it's like, I, I got a lot of responses, bad responses. Well, not bad, just bad for me. There's <laughs> not, not wrong ones, just wrong for me. Anyway, we have a little mid boss. Uh oh. Oh, like fancy electrical Owl effects. Owl original. Don't whiz on it. And no, hey, I'm music. Not on it. There's the music, and it's a rush. Hooray! What the? Hey, he does not. Rush. He, he, looks, he mean. looks too mean. Oh no! It's Blade. Like. It's Blade Wolf. Whoop! Jeez. I think it's like either this weird. one or the one after this. I found kind of annoying. Oh boy! This, this is like that one movie. Quick little sucker, isn't he? Yes, Was he Axel is. any good? I don't know. <laughs> Nobody saw it. Oh, darn. Ouch. Actually, I felt. Oh, to... That's like I'm asking to... if Nutcracker in the Four Realms was good. Nobody saw it, and nobody like even remembers Engine... that it came out not even a month ago. That's like asking if Mortal and no one's allowed to like it. But yeah, just going back to Robot Dogs real quick. Mortal Engines was Legends actually version... okay. Well, okay, I was about to, to say, um, what do you think a Legends mm -hmm. version of Rush would look like? Not sure, really. I mean, you can just see a normal dog. I mean, yeah, that's really all I need. For some okay. reason, I imagine him being like great, uh, like a great Dane in the Legend series. Nah, I could see him being like a for total, me. Like, for me, guy. I just imagine him being voiced by John Bailey again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That could work. So we're gonna keep moving along here in this blizzard, and again, mini map is our good friend. We have a new type of enemy that we have a new type of enemy There's to a bot what. By. Where? Oh, I don't you're see anything. crazy. I see a harmless snow mound. Oh, Definitely okay. not an it's elephant total, tank. Not really adorable. It's an elephant tank, which is a new enemy type we gotta deal with later. It's but a tank as you see, the, which as you see again, that can help. Really elephant. Which is <laughs> elephant? No, that, that that is a disgrace to the name of elephant. <laughs> also, the um, careful, 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 careful. But Gator Golf is better. Okay, and the. Again, the freaking exploit of rapid fire just destroys anything. Yeah, it's a godsend in the most obnoxious of times. I don't know how. I, I don't I actually. I actually don't know how like weak these things are supposed to be. If you're on like class B yeah. as opposed to class S. You were getting oh, yeah, a man. pretty good beat with the gun there for a second, like. Psh, 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 psh. 
fall with the and out of nowhere there comes oh, a char boy. there comes the charging elephants oh boy I'm not the the elephant dun, 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 dun. the crash music jeez oh jeez <laughs> Uh, funny you mentioned Crash because, um, just to give people a bit of context, one of the gifts I got for Christmas was the Insane Trilogy for the Switch. <laughs> not cool, oh. not cool! Run, run, run! Okay. Wow, they don't, they really don't give you a lot of leg room to get through this. No, they don't. Apparently Welcome not. Anyway, um, like I said, um, with the Insane Trilogy, I'm kind of going back and forth between Crash 1 and 2. As far as 1 goes, hey, I Dana. just got past the point of Koala Kong. And with two, I'm still in the middle of the, the second oh. area. According to my readings, it should be somewhere close by. Mm. Also, don't, 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 don't pay no mind to how Data keeps on and keeps on getting ahead of us. Well, I see a really, really suspicious dude, anyway. Dad. So let's go look at that one. Mega Man, what did you do? I'm picking up a massive energy surge. I think it might be a giant razor blade. Oh, what? That's it why you don't. That's why you don't touch the Mega floaty, Man. glowy things. Cause shit to start going haywire. Like oh, wow, the we really are losing her. Wow, just like we lost Matt. Uh, <laughs> don't worry, he'll, he'll be back soon. Okay, we're well, hopefully we're gonna connect with my Mac. Oh, oh god, gosh, that's a giant elephant. elephant. Mega oh, elephant. Actually, actually, the way his head looks, he does look like elephant. What do you think, Matt? Is that a giant elephant or what? It looks like an elephant. Oh gosh, and doesn't he has look, this attack. Really look, elephant. So he has this attack that's annoying. I mean, you just keep strafing around him. Oh, I get. Nope. Wait, Again, the, Ow. Whole, Ow. <laughs> again, the whole nudge, nudge and gun, nudge and gun trick still works as good as ever. But you have, but you do have to be careful uh, in the attack. A little too close. But you do have to be okay. Jump now, okay. But you do have to be careful in moments like these because you don't want to. When you're doing the nudge and gun, you want to make sure you don't accidentally nudge into the enemy. Right. Oh, geez, and geez, this geez. enemy loves getting in close quarters with you. Yeah, it's especially close. Like I think he's a little too close in this instance. Hey there, buddy. <laughs> Give me a hug. He's filling up the screen. Get it out. Seriously, oh, Elephant, crap. back off. Oh, hold the hands. But, all in all, there we go. Blow up some of his trunk a bit. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I almost forgot oh. about that, actually. Okay. And okay. I'm sorry. He goes. Oh, God. I'm going to die. He's having a little too much. He's having a little too much Elephant with us. And, as always, make sure to save frequently because if you, uh, oh, jeez. Oh, actually, okay. for the sake of oh, a comparison, this. Um, mainly because of the giant tube on the top of his head, he kind of looks like that obnoxious mammoth boss from Dream Team. Oh, I remember what you're talking I almost, about. I almost forgot about that, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? That's right. He does look like I actually... Whoa. Whoop. Anyway, um, as... Ow, oh, gosh boy. dang it. Okay, yeah, the shockwave still hurt. And as a reminder, save often in this game because if you die, it is just straight to main menu. Mm-hmm. They no, they really don't give you much in the way of leeway when you get a game over. Oof. Hi. Jeez, oh jeez. Welcome back. Hey. hey. I think Discord and my internet are having a bitter divorce. Ow. Oh my god. Oh, because my what internet is working for fucking everything else. Right. But Discord. It's stupid. Aww. Well, well, what we'll do you have to say about up. this boss, man? We need to know, Matt. Who's, soon. We need to know, Matt. Who's gonna keep the kids? <laughs> who's gonna keep possibly. the Who's gonna keep the elephant? <sighs> oh shoot! Stop Oop. it! Anyway, so after that. Anyway, I like how this elephant shoots you not with its trunk but with its ass. I was well, about I tried to say, shooting it looks ice like out of its trunk, but I kept blowing it up. Actually, you say that to me, it kind of looks like he's basically whizzing out asteroids. Oh, my God. Oh, gosh. I'm Why not... didn't oh, I make no. that oh, one? Oh, no. So, actually, I guess I can say this, James. The, the shield thing is kind of in the game in that it looks like sometimes I should be dead, but it still gives me oh, one I last, one like... more joke, but it gives it's me one last, one. It gives me one last chance with that blinking red part, but... Okay, just keep moving I think straight. that's all it really does now. <laughs> straight, move it straight, move it straight, and... Done. Okay, it's dead. Nearly... I don't make the joke. Ugh, nearly dodged a bullet. Ha, ah, several. And with that, that was like a big like security system which is protecting the true treasure of the Forbidden Island. Which should be, because the storm is still going nuts. <gasps> the storm? It stopped. Oh, I guess the storm actually stopped going nuts. My bad. So the mammoth the is opposite. like a giant weather machine, or? Basically. Oh. It, was, it was interference for the, um... Oh, there's a sulfur bottom. 
It's been falling. Yeah. It's been it's been up in the air this whole time. We're still falling. It's been hours. <laughs> oh, don't been worry. We're all right. For thirty minutes. <laughs> Seriously, we it's been thirty minutes and we're still falling. Like what the heck? Look at me. I'm fine. Also we're gonna try and be a little more quiet for some of these cutscenes at some yeah, point. I think we're starting to get back to the beef first. And this is where this plot starts getting confusing. So pay attention. It's a it's a Mega Man Legends plot. I said pay attention. Gets confusing. Not this confusing. You'll, You'll see, see what I mean. Oh. Hey Claymore. Hmm. They got dizzy. <laughs> How come those old fogies are so chipper, huh? My stomach feels like it's been through a washing machine spin cycle. Uh, Tisa, look. It's Blue Boy. Pretty. Which, that's, why, that's one thing I'm kind of bummed about, is that even though they clearly know his name now, Teasel still calls Mega Man Blue Boy. Well, I think at this point he's pretty much adopted it as like a term of endearment. Yeah. In a sense, and you know, more. You know what they say, old, ha old habits die hard. And, like that the crystal. First, and it was on this day that <gasps> make that is this day that made I, I can't make the joke. Let's yeah, let's not say we did. It was oh, on this hello. day that Volnut It was on this day that Volnut saw something that made him a mega man. Oh god. Because Oh I see it. Remember folks, this is rated E for everyone. But the camera is always out of the way, and I don't know. I can clearly see that that one. Um, well, like, just hanging out. Meanwhile, I, I can see it, but it's not like it has any nips. Well, that's done it. They woke her up. The carbons have decided their own fate. This is because they've activated Mistress Sarah. Sarah, you've done enough for them, Mistress Yuna. And Yuna, you are required to relinquish the keys to her. No, it's not enough. It's not enough. Why did the master entrust that purifier unit with his genetic code? The purifier being us. It was his job to hunt down and eliminate all aberrant humans. So why did he become the greatest aberrant of all? There are still mm. too many unanswered questions. Understand that a fucking century. Exactly. Also, looks like that one dude. Uh, looks like that one dude rescued the not Hatsune Miku from that dropship we saw earlier. There's a reason for that. We'll get to that way later. Much later. Again, questions. What? The chances of such a possibility being true are non-existent. Uh, shows what shows what you know, Gats, because you don't. Never even tell know me the chances, this. kid. Uh oh, we better get out of here. Agreed. And off they super Saiyan Ooh. away. Also, pray you weren't pray you weren't the, aren't a sad sap that played this before the first game. Like me. Oh, yeah. I have no idea what the heck is going. Oh, I'm so sorry, James. <laughs> anyway. Ooh. It appears that Miss Yuna still does not intend to give you access to the keys, Mistress Sarah. Hello, knockoff Maurice LaMarche. What is she thinking? Her logic is as mysterious as was the Masters. So that was Yuna and you Geats. This is, do. um, yes. uh, sorry, the uh, Gats, sorry. That was Yuna Mistress Yuna. Up there was Mistress Yuna yeah. and Geats. Gats, sorry. And this is Mistress Sarah and Geats. One of the uh, Geats. I'm guessing the main antagonist. the keys to the library. Um, we can acquire and deal with the master's genetic code. He just saved her. She just saved her. She just saved the silver towel or something. Understood. I don't. I, yeah, I don't think she minds. Them. I don't think she minds all the um extra extra air. So let's go find out. Let's get to the bottom of this because they said the mother lover. Back to the sulfur here. bottom. What you? I don't How come we end up stuck in here? Think about it, Teasel. Do you think they're just going to have a press conference with what's happened? Yeah, they're going to listen in on the conversation. Yes. What was that blue fellow doing there anyway? Like anyway, yeah, the mother was supposed to be Wonder here, but sure. it wasn't. Now I'll get her this time, or my name's not. Shh. I'm picking something up. Oh. Okay, they gave her a towel. Mm -hmm. Ah, finally. So what you're saying is, if you have possession of these four keys. We can unlock the Mother Lode and save Mistress Sarah. Is that it? Ah. Correct. We are from the past, your ancestors. We are in a world we never made. Yes, these are totally not like the villains from the Bumblebee movie. We can totally trust them. <laughs> it's okay. Let's also remember this came well before the Bumblebee movie. 
which I heard is surprisingly good. It actually is good. I will admit I've heard it's it is the good. I've heard it's the, I've heard it's the best one in the franchise. It really is. And dear God, I hope it's a reboot instead of a prequel. Because if it's a prequel, it makes no fucking sense. I bet not. Anyway. Also, the, ga also the game doesn't make a clear enough distinction to that, but it's official artwork. Um, what's his name? Keats? Keats. He wears glasses. Wow, I never saw that. I never knew that. Again, it's yeah. only something you see in the official artwork. Much like so, you see that amazing square deal on Jeff. What the? Oh, oh. apparently oh. Bluto wait, wait, is wait, there. Wait, wait, Matt, Matt, listen, Matt, listen. Oh. <laughs> what the? Daryl, they were they were listening in on them listening in. Whoops. I thought we were supposed to also, as you, as also, Beryl just clearly You're noticed the mic and just like blew into it or something. <laughs> he gave him a rat. He gave him. He just blew on it like a hanky. Also, why are why is blue? Why do they have clones of Bluto as their guards? The more people you have working for you, the better you I don't know. What about you, you? And unfortunately, there's no way they the bonds are gonna try and hold it off. But Glide and Claymore know. Mm-hmm. Mm, I guess you're right. I could have had lip animations for what that, but no. Is split up and take over any town I was simply practicing right my ventriloquism role. What did you think? Watch. All right, boys. Look sharp. Let's go. I'll see you around. Come in, Bola. Maybe it's just me, but why it sounds different than he did in Tronbon? Oh, yeah, no. He has a different actor. I don't know if we brought that up already. It's just something we already noticed. we did. We did. And now that they are now aware, the race is on because now everybody knows about these freaking keys. And conveniently enough, all four keys are located on the nearby islands. And apparently, in the years that it's been a thing, no one's ever thought to get these keys and get the mother load. Well, that's where we come in. You're not going to drag them into your rescue and again, are you? so Blucher is well, going to have to Mega to Man go after the keys ourselves. And thus, without, welcome to the main quest of the game. Mm -hmm. Oh, Joy. Mm -hmm. Find the four crystals, I mean keys of the elements, I mean motherships, whatever. And hopefully not summon an entire apocalypse, I mean chaos, I mean crap. <laughs> yeah, especially not the crap. But on that note, ladies and gentlemen, our treasure hunt is on. Next part. Join us. Bye. Till next time. Bye. Farewell. I mean, goodbye. I mean, see ya.